What it is, guys, it is your old boy Pilk, and I'm coming back at you with the second half of this video. Now, uh, we started this video off with high hopes and all this stuff, and, you know, I'll be honest with you, at the risk of sounding like an elitist, I really feel like these ACAs are getting way too easy, okay? I get the free-to-play ones being fairly easy. Uh, when you get into some of the, the higher-end Dokkan Fests, I expect a challenge. Like, those 30 stones you get should mean something at the end of it. This one, this one's been pretty shallow. Let me show you the team that I'm currently using, okay? Um, this is a fully free-to-play team. Let me go find a, uh, an Ingoku. Obviously, this is not a free-to-play unit that I'm pulling here, but also at the same time, if you are free-to-play, you should be using the best unit you can as your friend unit, just 100%, okay? The team is, of course, LRVB lead. We're running uh, the two Super Saiyan Blues from the uh, recent DBS event. The physical, uh, yeah, the physical uh, UI Goku, the free-to-play one, Strength West Kai, and LR Piccolo, okay? And yes, LR Piccolo actually c comes in handy in this. That's how bad this is, okay? Now, first of all, I will say, uh, don't expect crazy damage. Like, we're not going to be producing insane amounts of damage on this. What we're going to be doing is lasting, and that's something that shouldn't be happening, at this stage on an ECA, just 100%. So, let's go ahead and take a look here. I don't really want to break these two up, but I might have to. Let's just see what happens here. All right. So, Goku is going to be a little bit of a disadvantage there, so I'm going to put Vegeta there. Drop that down, and then do this. Okay. And yes, I probably should have targeted uh, the uh, AGL, or I'm sorry, the, the Tech Vegeta with um, Goku, but I'm just not going to lose sleep over it at the moment. Okay. Mm, not really the best hit. I expected them to hit harder. Now... This super attack... No, actually, take it back. This super attack isn't going to hurt as much either. It's going to be like another... Okay, no, that actually... That actually didn't feel comfortable. But, again, I'm not... I'm not concerned. I'm not losing sleep here. Okay? The only thing is, this. these runs do take a long time. These runs are not fast by any stretch of the imagination. It's going to take a good minute for us to get through this. Okay? I'm going to keep Piccolo there, because as you know, Piccolo is just a really great tank. I'm going to put LRVB there, and I think I'm just going to ignore Piccolo and not give him any key. Because I only give LRVB all my key, take out that Trunks, and then just focus on uh, focus on uh, Vegeta then. LRVB should have no problem taking out Trunks, that's going to be, should, should pretty much one-shot him at this point. I mean, to be fair, and all that dodge is so great. I'm so glad I gave him dodge. Alright. There we go. He's not dead. Well, that's a bit surprising. I was expecting LRVB to either get a crit or a double, and he didn't do either, so... That's completely the thing. Okay. So after shooting my mouth off, we're actually in a bit of pain here. You know, they hit harder than they ever have before. But that's kind of what I expect. To be fair, though, this is a free-to-play team. It's not fully boosted or supported, so it's like... I'm getting hit. Doesn't feel good. Sure. But at the same rate... I would expect bigger, heavier hits from... Most anyone that's on this team. It's Once again, I'm just entirely underwhelmed by this EZA. This team should be struggling... And I feel like if it wasn't for the fact we're eating super left and right, this team is just kind of passable. So here we go. And I know these two, these two guys, when they're together like this, they tank like crazy. So I'm trying not to use that as my litmus test. But again, it's, it's really hard not to. Okay. And again, this is level 30. This is level 32. We're like way beyond anything at this point. Okay. Now, the only downside is here, I, I'm just going to have to use UI Goku and take him out. But, uh, I'm going to pass. 
you know what? I'm going I'm to pass. We'll put UI Goku in the end. And I'm just going to see what Piccolo can do. Just because I'm curious at this point. Okay. And let's see if we even need even need UI Goku for this. Remember, yes, Piccolo's type advantage, but yeah, he's not going to be hitting very hard like this. What's he going to do? Okay. Wasn't a great hit. Wasn't the worst hit. It's better than I expect out of Piccolo, just to be completely honest. And good hit there, and ooh, this actually might, that, that, this might hurt. No. Barely felt it. Barely felt it. So, and now he's dead. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a completely free-to-play team on level 32. Oh! Oh, he survived! Whoa! That's actually impressive, I'm not gonna lie. He squeaked that one out, and, uh... You know... Not like it's going to last much longer, so let's just kill him now. All done. Good day. So every time, every time I think he's dead, he just clings to life. But as you can see, like, compare this to, like, what you would see on level 30. This is actually a little bit harder. Level 30 was a cakewalk for me. I finished level 30 in, like, a minute and a half with this team. So that gives you a, a pretty solid idea of why I say this is a disappointing easy A. Because to me... I expected a fight, and I came here, and I got, these guys are just limp. It's just, like, punching meat in a rickety shack. It really is. It's it's spring training, if that. So, I'm going to continue on this quest, maybe. Um, I don't know. I want to see how far we can get with that team, you know? Because I really feel like that team is not good enough to go on. Because remember... This is a team that only slightly had a couple of advantages. Uh, this team, you know, it, it had some scrub units on there. It wasn't a very good team. And we still made short work of that event. So, if you go back and look at the team I was running before, the Realm of Gods, that was stuffed with uh, uh, int and strength units, like, they were just killing it. Like, they were just... In fact, I'll just go ahead and, and grab that team one more time. Let's go ahead and sell uh, that thing we just got where to go where to go oh, that's all in hold on there we go we'll sell these real quick and jump back in there and I'll grab the team that I had made before and to show you how hilariously simple this team is and again when I'm being a bit of an elitist here but I'm just saying if you have an easy a for a couple of summonable units I would think you'd want to set your easy A, uh, you know, your easy B, the battle for them, just a hair harder than this. Because this is, like, you know, I'd say free-to-play level, but I'm almost worse than the free-to-play units. Um, the 30 Dragon Stones have got me nothing because it's just, we just rolled through this and steamrolled the entire event. Um, yeah, I mean... It's just hard to explain how disappointed I was because I really came here to have fun and fight and it was just over and done with. I know some people like that. I'm not one of those people. I really enjoy... Uh, how do I word this without it sounding insulting? But I really enjoy playing the game and you know, going through it and seeing what we can do and then you get to something like that and you're like, oh, why'd I bother? So, here we go. Could have done those two the other way around, but I'm not even going to worry about it. Okay. No super attack. This might not feel good. This actually might hurt. Oh, no, it didn't. It tickled. So. 1.5 mil. Expected more out of him, but... That's just the downfall of the unit, not getting crits and not getting doubles like he damn well should with how much he's got in the ability system, but you know, that's, that's, that's completely the RNG, just shitting the bed. Okay, let's see what Topo does. He really needs Jerenda. See, he gets an additional. An additional with a crit. So, what the crap? 
All right, we'll put Jiren first on this one just because I know Topo's coming up shortly with him. Okay. And that probably will finish off Trunks if I had to guess. Either way, I'm going to focus on Vegeta. Okay. Looks good. And I love the fact that Jiren tanks, but you don't really need it here. Like, I, this team was kind of, I was really skeptical that this team was going to pull it off. But this team has absolutely just, like I said, embarrassed this event. Now, they're, they're squeaking on to, like, just tidbits of life at this point. Okay. Yeah, his monster doesn't do much. He's here mostly as a tank and to boost the other units. If I can get him on with Rosé, it'd be the best. But I didn't put him on the last rotation like I should. So, that isn't going to happen. And, of course, UI wrecks it all. Okay. This should have been two rotations, but we're now on our third. And I will be impressed and honestly disappointed if this goes on to a fourth. So, let's see what happens right here. Let's put him in the center. Yeah. Drop that down. There we go. No you super. I mathed that out wrong. That's okay. And... Vegeta dead. Bye bye Oh, no. I mean, again, not worried. Like, legitimately, the <laughs> this hasn't been a problem until now. They're just... They're just... You know, we're not getting crits, we're not getting double attacks, and so they're just hanging on to that last little shred of life. But, not anymore. They're done. Alright, cool. So that shows you the two teams that I was using. Now, like I said, that was the same team as this morning. That team just... And even, if you notice, like, that team took three rotations. The other team what, took four, I want to say, so... And that was the free-to-play team. So, like I said, seriously disappointed in this. I really just... Well, I'm not having fun running this because it's just not a challenge. It's just a steamroll, and then I don't even have to worry about the teams. Like, you can throw scrub units on the teams, and they just walk in there and step all over everybody. I'm curious if I run just a straight Remigods team with without worrying about type, like just my best Remigods units, what they're going to do to this. Because I imagine they're probably just going to step on it and grind it into mush. So, we'll try that. I'm going to see how far up I can get with this regular Remigods team, but... You know, taking my sweet time, because frankly, what's all this? That said, I do have all the medals, so I will go back and do damage tests of Trunks and Vegeta once we get them easy aid, but that's neither here nor there. Let me know what you guys think of this. Were you guys as disappointed as I am? Am I being a drama queen about it? Because I have my expectations of Extreme Sea Battle. I really do. But that's me. And you guys know, as masochistic as it might be, I enjoy a challenge. And when it comes to this, I expect a challenge. And... Well, past few easy A's have really let me down, so we'll see. Either way, guys, let me know what you think in the comments section down below. We'll do our test here in the next couple of days. Like, comment, share, subscribe, follow my Birdman, hit me up a booger, do what Topo says, or else I will lay your ass out next time.